today I'm going to introduce you to electrical measuring instruments. Electrical measuring instruments are divided into two, analog and digital. The analog ones are these meters you see here. They measure by deflection of a pointer moving along a graduated scale. The first analog instrument we have here is the galvanometer. The galvanometer is used to measure slight currents. It can detect or measure little currents and give you the value. The second one is the ammeter. The ammeter is an improved form of the galvanometer and this is used to measure current for end rating. The ammeter is a low resistance device and is connected in a series with the circuit for which the load current is to be measured like shown in the circuit here. The voltmeter is used to measure potential difference between two points. It measures voltage, that is potential difference between two different points in a circuit. The voltmeter is a high resistance device and it should be connected in parallel. And the other ones are digital measuring instruments. They include the wattmeter. This is a single phase wattmeter. This wattmeter is used to measure single phase power for consumption. It measures kilowatt hour. This is a three phase wattmeter. This one, this one is a digital wattmeter, which is a three phase wattmeter. All these are used to measure three phase power in kilowatt hour. The other one is the multimeter. It consists of very many meters, which are designed in one meter. That is the, there is the ohm meter and the many other. The other one is the clamp meter. The clamp meter, which is used to measure current by sensing the electromagnetic field that is generated by current flowing through a conductor. The other one is the Q-meter. The Q-meter is also called the LCR meter. It's used to measure the Q factor or the quality factor of a coil. It can also measure the inductance, capacitance or the resistance of the circuit. The other one is the lux meter. The lux meter is used to measure brightness. It measures the intensity of brightness of a lamp. We also have the ESR meter or equivalent series resistance meter is used to measure internal resistance of a capacitor and hence calculate the capacitance of that capacitor. You can measure capacitor while still in a circuit board using the ESR meter. The other one is the mega meter. We also call it the insulation tester. It's used to measure the insulation resistance of a winding in a motor. The other meter is the earth leakage tester. The earth leakage meter, it measures any current which is leaking out of your circuit up to the earth. Cathode ray oscilloscope, the CRO. The CRO is used to analyze voltages as they change with time. 